I test makeup for a living and I decided to try all of my long wear foundations back to back doing a full day wear test to find the best one. Go back if you missed days one through four. This video is going to have five, six, and seven. First up is the Catrice HD Liquid Coverage. This one's more matte than the popular True Skin, but it's really beautiful. It's nice and thin in consistency. This is how it looked at the very beginning of the day. And this is at the end of the day. It's kind of patchy on my chin and I do look shiny, but overall it's still completely intact. This one's a surprise. I'm going eight out of 10. Day six is the Milani Conceal Imperfect. This is too dark for me because it's my self tan color, but we're and roll this with one's it. thicker in consistency and has a much more dewy finish compared to the Catrice one. Super full coverage. This covers absolutely everything. This is how it looked at the beginning of the day and here's at the end it of the day. It faded around my nose but was intact everywhere else. It just looked really shiny and my pores looked big. Six out of ten. Day seven's a long time favorite. This is Hard Candy Glamouflage. This is less full coverage than Milani and somewhere between Milani and Catrice in terms of how matte it is. Even though I didn't look shiny at the end of the day, it went super patchy on it me. It both pains and surprises me to say I'm going to give this one a five out of ten. That's why testing these back to back is the only way I think we're going to get the real answer.